Hello everybody, Kurt with Strange Beacons here, and I'm coming to you with my latest Arduino project, and it is a temperature and humidity sensor. This was a really simple project. Uh, it took a little bit of tweaking with the code, but I finally figured everything out, and this is the end result. Uh, the simplest part of it was, you know, it was wiring up the little DHT11 humidity and temperature sensor that you can see right here. Uh, it's a little bit more um, involved with wiring up the LCD display, but fortunately I already had a project where I had wired up an LCD and the only thing I had to do was add in an extra potentiometer here and of course the sensor itself and then it was all just a matter of um, writing up the finding some code online from a project that I found and then because it was displaying the temperature in Celsius and I wanted Fahrenheit that was the more difficult part and I wound up having to look high and low for that and as it turns out it was just a very simple little string of text that converts Celsius to Fahrenheit um, about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine little characters in there, and it changed it. So anyway, this has been a fun little project. Um, what I'm going to do is go ahead and I will post a link to the website that I used as my basis for creating this, and it's from a group called Circuit Basics, and I'll put a link down in the description. Um, of course, my, uh, my end product looks different from what you're going to see here in their photo because I already had, uh, you know, my breadboard and Arduino and the LCD mounted onto one of those little plastic um, project holders. And it comes in a little bit neater that way. But anyway, I will upload all of this, including a link to the code that I will link over to my uh, labyrinth13.com website. So anyway, um, love this. You know, it's I've been doing a lot of stuff with Arduino, and this is probably the most practical thing that I've created yet. So it's kind of a good feeling to have something like this that's really useful around the house. Simple, but useful. Thanks for watching.